worse than I thought. Hey, man. You want to go with us? We're going to go intimidate that Verizon store into letting us use their bathroom. Right on. Wait, don't I recognize you three from somewhere? I know. You used to be multicultural members of the Burger King Kids Club. A girl, a black kid, and a paraplegic. All friends somehow. Yeah, that's us. But we took off when they changed their fries. Well, let's do it, man. I'm one of you. Just looking to agitate. Okay, you're in. But first, douse your bandana in this tear gas neutralizer. Huh. Smells a little like ether. <sighs> Where... where am I? A foxhole on the front line in the war for class equality. Why are you doing this? I thought we were Coolio. Yeah, we know you work for the CIA. Only a narc would wear those mirrored shades. But my daughter told me they would make me look really cool, and oh, I get it, she set me up. I'm stupid. Oh, we can fix that. Let the re-education begin. Kristoff, hit the energy-efficient lights. Ah, the tint of the glow is slightly off. Ah! Wake up, G-Man. It's time to hear the truth. And the most efficient way to convey that truth? Poetry slam. Death on 9-11. Unhealthy food in 7-11. Instagram? No, thank you, ma'am. Television news is society's bruise. Makes me want to drink booze. Because Poe Buddy's nerfed. Hello. I'm Ira Glass. <laughs> Today on This American Life, we have a story about a dog. And like most dogs, this dog has an owner. But here's the thing. This dog's owner also happens to be a dog. Why is he pausing? Doesn't he know what he wants to say next? Doesn't he have it written down right in front of him? Ah! We've just received a disturbing report that a local man has been kidnapped by radical Occupy protesters and subjected to heaven knows what. Journalistic ethics prevent us from releasing the man's name, but between you and me, it's Stan Smith. Stan? Daddy? Dad? Ow! Hang now. We are a radical arm of the Occupy movement. We have several demands. The rich should give their money to the poor. Then the new rich should give their money to the new poor. And then they should go round and round like the... the Sneetches? Is that what that is? Also, there should be a one-year waiting period to get a gun. And at the end of that year, you don't get a gun. Witnesses report that the victim stood out because he was wearing mirrored narc shades. Oh, my God. I told Dad to wear those sunglasses. This is all my fault. Well, then you better just hope he doesn't get out of there alive. Good morning, USA. I got a feeling that it's gonna be a wonderful day. The sun in the sky has a smile on his face, and he's shining a salute to the American race. Oh boy, it's well to say. Good morning, USA. 